Be life. Hey, Shalom. No, go ahead. Go, go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. Thanks. Yeah, it's a sidewalk. Hey, Shalom. These are the, we're the brothers of GMS Toronto. We're coming back with another one. And we'd like to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh. Yahweh We'd like to say double honors to the elders and the elder apostles of GMS. They rule well and they teach well. And to the rest of you brothers on the four corners of the earth doing this work in truth and in sincerity. Hey, Shalom. Um, a lot going on. I'll just start off with the movie. Uh, um, hey, Shalom, brother. Yahweh I'll just start off with a movie. What is it called again, brother? Uh, leave the World Behind. Yeah, Leave the World Behind, man. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. And that movie, Leave the World Behind, is actually, um, uh, uh, um, what do you call it? A, a for, a, it's a foretelling of what's to come, right? But it's too late for you people. You people have been fatted up, man. Can we get the one? Um, I want to go to the, if you have something, you could bring it up, but I want that scripture on the woman where it says, um, uh, 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 um, you women that are at ease. Oh. That goes for you men as well. You women are being fatted up for the slaughter. And it's too late for you. You know why? Because your mind has been seared with iron. Can you get that one as well? Your mind has been seared with iron. Hold on. Let the elder get this and then you get what you got. Yeah. Okay, so this is Isaiah chapter 32, verse 9. Rise up, ye women that are at ease. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Yeah, because this society is a careless society, man. How is this society careless? Because you're not living the way that you should be living, which is according to the law, statutes, and dictates of the Most High God. And when you don't live according to the laws of the Most High, this is what happens. You have a society that's in chaos. You have a society that's in degradation, right? Your society is going down. Why? No morals. Where do you get morals from? You get the law, statutes, and commandments of the most high. And because you don't have none of that, you people are doing things that's contrary to how you're supposed to be living off of the land. And because of that, there's going to be judgment. And the judgment that's about to come upon this place is going to be RFID technology, nuclear missiles. Go ahead. Uh, you hear my voice, you careless goddess. Give me your speech yeah and they're not gonna give ear right when we go to proverbs 1 verse 20 they fan their hands right if you get proverbs 1 which we don't have to get they fan their hands they hear our words and they fan their hands to understand we've we've been living about going all the way back to the babylonians to the greeks to the egyptians to the romans it's already been written in the bible it's called prophecy that's all we're here for. We're here to tell you what's going to happen before it happens, man. Go ahead. It says, uh, many days and years shall you be troubled. And you're going to be troubled because of what? You're going to be troubled because of disobedience. That's mm -hmm. it. You're not going to be troubled because you're a woman. That's stupid. Women are amazing. Women are the gift from the Heavenly Father. Women are amazing when they're in the right mind. But in this society, these women are completely out of order completely out of order they disrespect men they look down upon men and they forget the authority of a man in this society man and because of that you're going to be troubled and the most high is going to bring it all the way back to where you're going to need a man it's going to show you exactly what the strength of the man is the man is a protector and he's a provider go ahead says, ye careless women, for the vintage shall not fail, the gathering shall not come. Yeah, the gathering shall not come, man, which is the delectacies that you, you women see. You see feminism going to a place to where you're not just going to get equal pay, you're going to get above pay. You're not going to get equality to men. You want to be above men. You want to tell men what to do, man. You want to lead us. But have you conquered anything? Have you, have you women conquered the land? Tell me what society a woman has conquered. What war? Did they conquer the, the, the Roman society? The Greek society? Who, 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 who's the great generals that are women? Who are the warriors in history that are women? I don't know any. Go ahead. It says, tremble you woman. And you're going to tremble, man. You're going to tremble. When this society starts to collapse, and it's collapsing right seeds. When it really starts to collapse, man, 
and all of this shit is shut down and there's no more uber because you need people like this. you need people like taxis you need people like police that's what women need women need all of that men we don't need all of that man men are survivors we know how to survive without cars we know how to survive without electricity Cut. we know how to survive without a house Cut. you the reason why we build homes is for you women the reason why we built cars is for you women. All of society, this metropolis, which is a mother city, was mm -hmm. built for women. For us to say, okay, we've conquered, and now I want my family to live good. Us men can live in a damn tent, and we're happy. That's a men, we're survivors. But now, we've given women all of this, and now that they think they're better than us. So now it's time for the most high to bring this world crashing down to show you that you need men. That's right. And for you men to understand that you need God. That's how it works. It's order. You women need men. You men need the most high. That's right. Read. It says here, you careless one, strip you and make you bare and gird sackcloth upon your And what made the woman careless? It goes all the way back to the garden, the knowledge. It was the knowledge that she received. She received the serpent's knowledge. And the serpent's knowledge is what? Is women empowerment, is, is uh, 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 lesbianism, which is homosexuality. In this society, we don't call it what it is. Why don't we call lesbianism homosexuality? Because as men, we're turned on by that. But what is it according to the law, statutes and commandments? It's homosexuality. When you see two women kissing, homosexuality. Two women are not supposed to be in the bathroom looking at each other and do it. No, that's homosexuality. Just like you're not supposed to look upon another man's nakedness. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing that goes for women. Go ahead. Verse 12. They shall lament for the teats, for the pleasant fields, for the fruitful vine. And that's what I was just speaking about. What's the fruitful vine? Everything that you see, brother. Deliveries at an instant. Sephora. Uh, Yorkdale, uh, 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 um, uh, these girls' trips, uh, all inclusive, uh, what do they call all inclusifications? And then when you go to these places, some of these women don't even have to spend any money because yeah. us men are going to these places to spend. You have women that have testimonials that they go out to clubs with a dollar. She's like, I've got a, hey, I have a testimony, I just want to see if I can go to the club, I have a dollar. And she leaves the club with money. She she's drunk. She's getting she's getting this all because of men. All because of men. Go ahead. That was it. The water, brother. This is first first Timothy one one. Now the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of. And that's the world that we live in right now. The doctrines, the doctrines of devil first is going to start with uh, um, going against the scriptures, the complete, the turning of the scriptures. But now we have something known as democracy. We have something known as uh, 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 liberalism. These are all wickedness as well. The ideology of these things is wickedness, but it all goes against the scriptures, man. That's all that it is. We just have to simplify it for brothers, man. This is not complicated. When you turn against the scriptures, that's the seducing spirits. Yeah. You're allowing that's spirits to enter you, man. Because what is what is happening right now? We're at a buffet, a buffet right now. Brothers are eating right now. And there are certain things that you're gonna take in, and there are certain things that you're gonna disregard, man. And that's the same thing with this society, man. And this society is trying to feed you with what? With toxins, man. Go ahead. It says uh, verse two. Speaking lies in hypocrisy, conscience seared with a hot iron. And that's what makes our job so hard. What? Our jobs as Christians, why is it so hard? Because the only thing that we're doing is speaking the truth. Can you read that again, brother, what you just read? This is why our job as prophets is so hard. Verse 2. Yes. Speaking lies in hypocrisy. So that's these people coming against us, and all they have is lies and hypocrisy. Go ahead. Having their conscience seared with a hot iron. That's the problem with them. They have their conscience seared with a hot iron with the ideologies that they have learned from they were young, from their mothers, from their, their grandmothers. Yeah? Yes, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna read verse one from the NLT. 
It says, now the Holy Spirit tells us in the last time, some will turn away from the true faith. They will follow deceptive spirits and teachings that come from demons. Jeez. These people are hypocrites and liars, mm -hmm. and their consciences are dead. Jeez. Yeah, that was the point. Yeah, that was the point. God. For you. This is a uh, second Ezra 15 verse 1. Yeah, good scripture. One will be made in uh, verse uh, 4. Behold, speak thou the ears of my people the words of prophecy, mm -hmm. which I will put in thy mouth, saith yep. the Lord, and cause them to be written in the paper. For they are faithful and true. Fear not the imagination against thee. Hey, and do are we saying that the word of the most high is faithful and true because we said so? No. Go and do your own research. Everything that we tell you, go and research yourself, just like the Church of Berea. And, and just receive information from a Do is something known as reasoning. Reason with another man, you go and check out what that man has said. You don't look at another man and because he is he is white or because he is he's this or because he's that, you say, I can't reason with you. As, as, as knowledge, something you have to be able to reason with him, take out the, the foolish and use the, the, the goodness. As a man, the only man with his ears to knowledge and information is an emotional man who is a weak man. An intelligent man deciphers all knowledge, all wisdom all understanding because an intelligent man wants to find out hey even if this guy's a murderer why is he a murderer even though he this an intelligent man is gonna dig deeper oh man ah, look, fuck you you're you're this ah, fuck ah. no sometimes you reason with people to find out what's going on to get deeper knowledge man you have to you have to supplant, aren't you a Jacob? You be Jacob means to supplant. You have to be able to supplant people out of knowledge as well. Sometimes you act like you're completely lost. Sometimes you act like you have and you let people reveal onto you what it is. Because sometimes you come with the sword and people are not now they're not gonna reveal anything to you because you came so quick with the sword. Instead of for you just relaxing, letting people get comfortable, they open up and they tell you, hey, you know I'm a Luciferian? Hey, are you serious? Oh man, that's crazy. How'd you get into that? Okay, okay, cool. Oh, I know that I can't fuck with you. Oh, fuck, you're a Luciferian. Oh, it doesn't have to be like that. Uh, hold on, let the brother get his point. Verse 3, so fear not the imaginations against thee, yep. let not the incredulity of them so trouble thee, yep. speak against thee. Yep. For people shall die in their unfaithfulness. Read that again, brother. Right. Let's lock it. You got the second Ezra is chapter 15. No, that part. Oh, let all the unfaithful. Oh, okay. Chapter 15, verse 4. Yep. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. Because that's coming out of the Bible. That's coming out of the Bible. This world promotes the scriptures as forgiveness. No, it says that all the unfaithful, read it again, brother, go back with shop. Because I don't want them to think that I'm pushing hatred. It says, for all the unfaithful shall die in their they unfaithfulness. They shall die in their unfaithfulness. Thus said the word of the Most High. Not me. The Most High said that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this has nothing to do with me, man. Because I can die as well for my unfaithfulness. This doesn't just go one way. I'm not projecting something that cannot be turned back on myself man the heck just like in the movie uh, um the world is ended what's it called yeah, Leave the, yeah, whatever. <laughs> good movie <laughs> but yeah, it's, a, yeah, yeah, it's, a <laughs> it's a really good name because that's exactly what lot did man right and all the, the going back to noah did noah not leave the world behind hold on leave the world behind that's what the most high told us to do the most I said, come out of the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Jeez. So it's a great name. You have the scripture? Sure. This is um, Deuteronomy, uh, chapter 4, 5, the points, and 6. 
Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgments, even as Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushai, our power, commanded me that he should do so in the land for you to go and possess it. Keep therefore and do them, for this is your wisdom. Yes, because this is our life. This is what uplifted us from the, the, the level of a beast. This is how we know that the heavenly nations, mm -hmm. because he never uplifted all nations to this level of cleansiness, right? Which is where we get the word holy, right? Why is the nation, why is the nation of Israel holy? We're holy because of the law, statutes, and commandments, right? Mm -hmm. We're not holy because we just walk around as Israelites. No, we're holy because this law, statutes, and commandments was given for us to keep, right? It wasn't given for anybody else to keep. You don't see the Most High punishing Esau for eating pork? Where's the Most High killing them? I just watched the video of this Edomite uh, cooking a meal in a in a plain bathroom. In the hotel, in the, right? in, in the motel, <laughs> in the motel. Yo, he has a whole channel, man. A nasty motherfucker. Yeah, so and crazy. he's good. And he's good. No health issues, no nothing. <laughs> But I bet if you chick try to do something like that, you're gonna end up in the hospital. <laughs> I, think, I, I think you cooked the lips, you put on, you put the hair dry. It was a hair dry. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't even cooked. Oh, Holy shit. So oh my God. Shit was still pink, so I can really go ahead. Holy Keep therefore and do them, for this is your wisdom and your understanding. This is our separation right because it's not how, how do you become separate because it's not like it's not like we can't do business with the other nations right but this is going to make us this is going to make the other nations at us and be like wow oh you're oh you don't allow your woman to wear pants oh your oh your woman is in order oh just like when we see the, 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 the women in the Middle East, we don't look at the women like the women are so great. We look at the men like, wow, okay, you guys are doing something. You have to give that man respect. That's the same thing we would have got from all of this knowledge, wisdom, and understanding that comes from the, the, the laws, man, that the Most High has given to the children of Israel. People would look at us like, wow. Go ahead. And your understanding in and, the and sight. You know, hold on, brother. And you know why it comes with wow? Because these laws commandments come with the number one trait of a man, which is discipline. Mm -hmm. These laws, what makes these laws manly is because of the discipline that comes from these laws, man. You got to be disciplined to keep the law, statutes, and commandments. I'll tell you that. Go and, and your understanding in the sight of the other nations. That's right. We shall hear all these statutes and say, surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. Yeah, and that's what makes us great. That's what makes us wise. That's why when people come up here and they hear what we're doing and they're just like, oh, a bunch of niggas, they're not selling drugs, they're not pimping, they're not doing anything contrary to the law all they're doing is reading the bible and telling their people to be better wow this is what the nation of israel should be like we're upstanding people we're the most upstanding people in the whole entire world that's right because of the law statutes and commandments there's nobody like us look at the people who are in our land today they're not upstanding go ahead on for what nation is there so great exactly and go through our history. And I'm talking about when our people were actually doing what was right according to the Most High. See, our name rang bells. Our name rang bells. People were afraid. They were threatened. They couldn't wait. That's why in Psalms 83, it says, raise it, raise it. Because they're like, no, we can't have a people like this. Are you crazy? A people that God is gonna defend? And that's why they, they, they also, uh, 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 um, said that they gotta come together, man. Come together to keep us down. Yeah. They have become a uh, confederate. The water, Elder. Go ahead. Who has Yahweh so nigh on Exactly. Exactly. Who? That's how you know you are the people of the Most High. Because who else, which other nation has been so nigh unto the Heavenly Father? There's none. And you could go through the list. 
And when we go through the list of them, all these other nations, all their gods are idols. So that's yeah. how we know this doesn't pertain to them. Because the reason why they have all these idols is because of what happened at the Tower of Babel. And then when, when they got scattered and they went throughout the four corners of the earth, they kept that, <laughs> uh, 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 that idol worship and brought it with their new language and changed the name of the god Nimrod, Simiramis, and Tammuz into what you know today. Because that's all they're doing. They're just worshiping man. That's all they're doing. They're worshiping Nimrod, they're worshiping uh, uh, Tammuz, and they're worshiping Semiramis, which is the mother goddess. All the way from the tower, all the way to 2023, going into 2024, and people are still worshiping idols. Damn. Go ahead. As the power, Yahweh, what Yahweh hey, shy. Hold on, that's why they just brought, that's why their, uh, 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 their idol, which is Barack Obama, just made their movie, because he's Nimrod. <laughs> that's Nimrod in the reincarnation, right? That's Nimrod right there. That nasty uh, <laughs> idol and branch of the Right? So these people are heavy on that, right? Mm -hmm. That's a big 55. Oh my gosh. Hey, and that's why the, the hand, one is up, one is down. Mm -hmm. It represents as above, uh, so below. below, man. Yeah. Right? The brother was mentioned in the 69 tattoo on mm -hmm. the girl. That's the representation as as above, so below. That's the principles of masonry. That's also the principles of um, uh, 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 um, oh my, um, no, not just yin and yang. Yin and yang goes back to um, uh, 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 what's it called? It's chemistry. There's a there's a name for it when you bring metals together and you change it. Alchemy. 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 The water, brother. That's the, the that's alch that's the alchemical process of changing something so because they think that when you change something in alchemy you make it better so they said you take a woman and you make her more masculine now she's the perfect human that's how they they feel in their mind go ahead uh, this is uh second chronicles chapter 9 verse 1 going back going to your point about uh, how we're supposed to be knowledgeable or we're supposed to be wise i think solomon was a, was a perfect example of that well mm -hmm. you know what i mean We'll break it down when you read it then. Okay, so this is Second uh, Chronicles chapter 9, verse 1. And when the queen of Sheba heard of the fame of Solomon, and she came to prove Solomon with hard questions at Jerusalem with a very great company and camels that bear spices and gold in abundance and precious stones. And when she was come to Solomon, she communed with him of all that was in her heart. And Solomon told her all her questions, and there was nothing from Solomon which he told her not. And uh, the into it, you know, we were given laws such as commandments, and some laws such as commandments, but why is it with Solomon? But Solomon was in his right mind, he knew everything, he knew all things, all things weren't hidden. So he gained fame because of that, and that's what we're all going to get in the kingdom, pretty much. Actually, we're all going to be liking something, we're going to be perfect. Hey, and well, we have answers right now, which is really, a, which is really a blessing onto Yahweh Hashem Shai, man. What you can come and, and ask us that we don't have the answer for? Remember that that wasn't us in the world. <laughs> Remember, in the world, and the reason why we were seekers of wisdom is because we never had the wisdom we never had the answers that's why our people they go into all these different ways of doctrine now because we have the knowledge because we have the wisdom because we have the understanding we have the answers man and that's what gives you the stability and that's righteousness according to Yahweh Shemel Shai man that's righteousness there is nothing that your son your daughter your woman can come and ask you and you don't have the answer to that just for that alone that's why it says that uh, 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 we're rich that's why it says we're rich you know much rich men look at whether it's one of the richest men in our nation and he is an unintelligent person i'm sorry to tell you he's made great business decisions around him mainly this white guy um his I I can't remember the white guy's name, but 
citizens of the United States. I think he went to Harvard and he handles where there's money decisions. But overall, he is not an intelligent man. Mm -hmm. It just is what it is, right? He doesn't have the answers that you have. So with all that money, because remember the scripture says, with all that getting, get understanding. With all his getting, he never got it. Go ahead. The book of Baruch, chapter 4, verse 1. This is the book of the commandments of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, and the law that endureth forever. All they that keep it shall come to life. Do you know why it endures forever? Because this is how you're supposed to live. Without it, you cannot live. And that's what we already found out when we when we study our history. When we study our history as a people, the reason why we fell, the reason why we're being ruled over right now by an unmelanated person or a person that lacks melanin is because of our disobedience to the Most High. That's right. That's why we fell. The reason why you're in the condition that you're in today, being the la a, a, a last hired, first fired, the reason why you you live in the ghetto, the burials, the reason why you Native Americans are drinking rum and alcohol, there's a reason for that. Because I know, as a righteous man, you have to scratch your head and be like, oh my gosh, why are these people living like this? I used to ask myself that as a kid. As a young child, I used to look at Native Americans and be like, why do they live like this? Because when I was growing up, when I was young, they used to do something called sniff glue. Mm -hmm. They used to sniff glue to get high. And I used to wonder why. Why would somebody want to do that? Because they're destroyed. And they're destroyed spiritually. <coughs> you can be destroyed physically. Every man up here has lost it all. We've lost financials. We've lost women. We've lost... We've lost places. We've lost cars. But there is nothing like being destroyed spiritually. When you're destroyed spiritually, man, there's no coming back for you, man. You're done. Go ahead. All day that keep it shall come to life. All day that keep it shall come to life. Right? So that means the majority of the world are in the congregation of the dead. So when you do reason with people about their knowledge, guess what? At the end of the day, their knowledge is going to bring death. It's going to bring destruction, man. That's all that it brings. Our knowledge brings life, man. We have to, the, that's why the Most High says, I, 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 not the Most High, I'm sorry. The, the Hawashai said, I, he told the woman at the well, the water that I have, you'll never thirst again. And the woman right. said, yeah, 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 I want that. I want that. And she didn't even understand what he was speaking about, man. Uh, you guys yeah, uh, Sirach 2 and, uh, 2 and 11, it reads, And the Lord Yahweh is full of compassion and mercy, long suffering, and very pitiful, and forgive sins and say in time of affliction, woe be unto the fearful hearts and faint hands, and the sinners that goes two ways, woe him, it's like a woe unto him that is faint hearted, for he believed. Therefore, to not be defended. Woe well, unto him that is faint hearted. Right? So the Lord is not dealing with uh, uh, tightrope walkers. Mm -hmm. Right? One foot in, one foot out. Right? Uh, straddling the fence. Mm -hmm. And the Lord is dealing with, 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 with uh, single eyed and focus in this truth. Go ahead. That's right. Verse 14. Woe unto you that have lost patience. And, have, and what will you do when the Lord Yahweh should visit you? Hey, that comes into our. Um, some of the people coming to this truth, right? It's, it's a long right? And you have to be patient. If you don't have patience with this, you won't make it. And we hope those men, because we don't know that. But that was it. Really suffering. You know, how long could you hold out while suffering? That's right. And that's what that patience is. That's right. Okay, I got uh, Proverbs. Uh, Oh, so like you. Yeah. Uh, verse 15. They that fear the Lord Yahweh will not disobey his word, and they that love him will keep his ways. Read that again. Uh, Sirach 2 and 15. They that fear the Lord Yahweh.
Lord disobey his word. Right, this knowledge, this wisdom, this understanding. You fear the Lord, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of, of, of wisdom, understanding. Right, so those that believe the Most High, Yahweh, Shema, Shine, right, they're gonna be, they're gonna be obedient. They're gonna, they're, they're gonna uh, keep the law to the best of their ability. They're not gonna sin more from you, right? That's right. And they that love him will keep his ways. Verse 16, okay. uh, they the fear, it's like you. They, <laughs> That's the word, man. <laughs> they the fear the Lord Yahweh will seek that which is well pleasing unto him, and they that love him should be filled with the law. Right. They that love the Lord will seek, that is, that is what, what was that again? Willing to his will? They the fear the Lord Yahweh will seek that will. Right. So they're going to seek, they're going to seek the truth. Scriptures say, ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh, they will be occupied in prophecy, right? Occupied means to be busy, to be working, right? So you're gonna be, you're gonna be, you're gonna be immersed in this truth. That's right. Go ahead. Hey, that's why we just broke down the movie, right? Or you know, we we attempted to. Obviously, it's a more personal video, but that's what we're up. We're, we're, we're thinking about prophecy. Yeah. Read, pleasing unto him, the day that love him should be filled with the law. Someone get a uh, song 147. Hey, who, who put up that video of the oysters for the mussel? Right? They're, they're, they're filters, man. Right? The, the shellfish. Right? And you, people eat that nasty shit. Oh, yes. One, they said one sh shellfish can filter how much? Uh, 40 liters of water? Damn. Or something like that per hour. Mm -hmm. Right? And then all that's in the tissue, and you're just, oh, I'm just saying, crack your ass. <laughs> 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 Uh, 147 verse 19 he showeth his word unto Jacob his statutes and in Jacob and his uh, judgment unto Israel right he shows his word unto Jacob right the, the elder just said he will seek his that, that which is old mm -hmm. right so the Lord's only dealing with one set of people the Israelites right he's so called a he's so called a team he's so called an eagle it's back on bird right have not dealt so with any nation. Right. The, the, the Mosai Yahweh Shimon is not dealing with none of these other nations. You Moabites, Ammonites, Ishmaelites. The Lord's not dealing with you. How might you? YouTuber. Yeah. Yeah, the guy Chris was this. The guy went to see that. Once I'm some hammers, some dirty, ugly hammers. <laughs> <laughs> They have right. not dealt so with any nation, and as for his judgment, they have not known them. Right, that's why you see these Hamites, there's videos that are viral, they're washing their heads in, in, in uh, piss. In house, house, house piss. I was watching right? a, 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 a yeah. made a video a couple, a couple days ago, or last week or something. He's going into the, the Hamite tradition. Yeah, right? Exactly, the Lord's not dealing with that. Right? Hey, and, and you have to remember that. Bah. That's yeah. the bath. That's not. Yeah. That's not just an anointing. They bathe in that, so they don't bathe with water. They call that the pee bath, yeah. and that's all that they use to bathe with. Is the pee. <laughs> that's the. That, that's the bath. Uh, yeah. Uh, and, and then you got Elon bathing in uh those those rivers Gang full of uh, oh, yeah. and shit. Yeah. Gang yes. And that's bold, right? <laughs> bold, and, and this shows you the Lord. 
the scripture said the Lord is going to cause these idols to move. Right. So I'm going to hold that in uh, Isaiah 19, verse 1. Right? For all the gods of the nation are idols, but the Lord made the heavens. Mm -hmm. Honor and mercy are before him. Strength and beauty are in the center. Right. The Lord Yahweh made the heavens. So the Lord Yahweh Mishim Eshai is above all these, these gods and these idols, these fake gods. Right? Yeah. And let me say it is because we have Israelites in that faith as well in that belief system right all, 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 even in India right so we have to we have to preach this word to them as well this is our first Samuel chapter 5 verse 1 and the Philistines took the ark of the most high and brought it from Ebenezer <laughs> onto Ashdod when the Philistines took it into the house of Dagon and set it by Dagon. And when they of Ashdod arose early on the morrow, behold, Dagon was fallen upon his face. Right, and you look at this God, Dagon, the, the fish God, right? You look at uh, the, 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 the RCC, their leader, the, the, their, their Pope, he wears a, uh, uh, I can't remember what it's called. Oh, the the miniature? Yes, and it, it's symbolic of, of, of the, the fish, fish God. Yes, yes. 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 It splits, yeah. Yeah. Right? And that's who you, you heathens out here worship, man. Right? Behold, Dagon was fallen upon his face to the earth before the ark of the And they took Dagon and set him in his place again. And when they arose early on the morrow morning, behold, Dagon was fallen upon his face to the ground before the ark of Yahweh. And the head of Dagon and both the palms of his hands were cut off upon the threshold. Only the stump of Dagon was left to him. Right, because the Lord Yahweh is the God of all, the, the power of all powers, man. These gods have no breath in them. These fake gods, they have no, they have no breath in them. They can't, they can't walk on their own. They got to be dusted in their, in their, in their cathedrals and their chapels, right? Yeah. But that's probably why they're getting in car accidents too, man. You know, the Lord's judging them. Yeah. Man. <laughs> yeah. All right, go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. This also goes with the commandment of, um, well, the, yeah, the commandment of God. It says, thou shalt have no other powers before me. So that's actually literal. You know, you can't put another power before the Lord, especially when it's near the ark. You know, the Lord's going to totally destroy that, right? Yeah, yeah. He said, you can't can make it. Or, you know, on earth or whatever, anything, right? People worship different. People worship the sun. People worship uh, a damn bird. You know, the phoenix, right? People worship all kinds of creatures. Verse five. Therefore, neither the priests of Dagon nor any that come into Dagon's house tread on the threshold of Dagon and Ashdod unto this day. And the hand of Yahweh was heavy upon them, Ashdod, and he destroyed them, That's right? And smote them with emeralds. That's right. Even Ashdod and the coast thereof. That's right. So when they erect that statue in Brampton, be prepared you know, for some heavy judgment in Brampton. That's right. Our pressure right. going up tenfold. I mean, the only problem you're not going to—it's not going to just be your premium that's going to be your problem. Your premium is right. going to go up. You're going to lose your your house. You're going to lose your lives. That's right. You're going to lose you lose your sanity, man. That's right. Uh, that's right. Hey, let me get this oh. real quick. This is from uh, Wikipedia, and this is on the day gone. It says, regarded as the father of gods, Mesopotamian mm -hmm. Enlil, spelled E-N-L-I-L, -L, or Horani Kumarabi, as well as a lord of land, a god of prosperity, mm -hmm. and a source of royal legitimacy, which is why the Pope has it on. Hold on. This is very important. It says both masculine and feminine. Mm. Okay, hold on. Attest that he was a popular deity. He was also worshipped further east in Mesopotamia, mm -hmm. where many rulers regarded him as the god capable of granting them kingship. Mm. So it's the fact that the Pope wears that should let you know something, right? Mm -hmm. The Pope is not to be played with. That's why all rulers from around the world have to go and bow to the Pope. <laughs> they all do. Gonna keep, uh, keep going into the into the guts. Uh, Psalms one fifteen and four. 
the reeds, the idols are silver and gold, the works of men's hands. They have mouth, but they speak not. I, eyes have they, but they see not. They have ears, but they hear not. Okay, so now, so now when you worship, uh, um, what's it called? The, the, the astrology, you have a god that name was Pisces. Pisces mm. is Dagon. So that's who you're worshiping when you're talking about, oh, I'm Pisces. Mm. That's Dagon. Which would which would be um so it, it, it's an example of Kush and Nimrod. Mm. So the father of Nimrod is Kush, right? Reads, uh they have ears but they hear not, noses have they, but they smell not, they have hands, but they handle not, feet have they but they walk not. Neither speak their, through their throat. They that make them are like unto them. So is the everyone that trusts in them. So our people are heavy into this. You know, uh, Jesus back in Brazil, the, the big statue that they have, yep. right? In yep. most of the countries, they have one of them. That's right. Right? That's right. Or they have them in their cars. Con. Yeah. The house. Yeah, in the house. They say it's first nine. Of Israel, trust <laughs> thou. Like Elder Tahar used to say, he used to go to his demon's mother's house and she has Jesus everywhere. <laughs> 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 Jesus. Uh, Jesus everywhere. <laughs> verse 9 of Israel, trust thou in the Lord Yahweh. He is their help and their shield. Is that a quick precept? This is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 14, verse uh, 9. For the ungodly and ungodliness are both alike hateful. Go ahead. No, I'm sorry. Verse, verse 11, sorry. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 14, verse 11. Therefore, even upon the idols of the Gentiles shall there be a visitation. That's right. Mm -hmm. Because of the creature of the Most High, they are become an abomination. Right. And stumbling blocks to the souls of men. Mm -hmm. And a snare to the feet of the unwise. That's right. Yeah. There's, a, there's an idol. Penis. <laughs> For the device of idols was the beginning of spiritual fornication, mm -hmm. and the invention of them, the corruption of life. That's right. For neither were they from the beginning, neither shall they be forever. That's right. Mm -hmm. For by the vain glory of men they entered into the world, right. and therefore shall they come shortly to an end. That's right. For a father afflicted with untimely mourning. When he hath made an image of his child soon taken away, now honored him as a god. That's right. Which was then a dead man and delivered to those that were under him ceremonies. Hey, that's what, but that guy's not on the floor. There should be a guy on the floor, and he was one of those dead men that was exalted, man, Sesha Boshir. He was actually around in the 1400s, man. Yeah, and he was a he was a part of a major crime family that even took over the the the, the um the Vatican the Atuada brother the papacy a better word took over the papacy and they took over the papacy by murder they murdered for that place uh, under him ceremonies and sacrifices verse sixteen thus in process of time an ungodly custom grown strong was kept as a law. And graven images were worshipped by the commandments of kings. It's just like tattoos, people get an R.I.P. or they yep. get the face. They mm -hmm. pour out the drink off of You know, it goes back to what you're saying about emotions, man. You openly love the person so much. Like, that do crazy shit at the funerals. i seen one where the guy, he loves had the, he had the casket there. And the guy hit the ball off the casket and he scored his last goal. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know, you know, those ones, you guys, those like, you know, they're like, they're, yes. you can't lose this person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're crying to the, you know? <laughs> the scriptures say, mourn seven days, man. Take, take seven days off. Yeah, you gotta right. do, but, yeah. but stand up after. Right? You know? Verse 16. <laughs> no, verse 17. Whom men could not honor in presence because they dwelt for off, they took the counterfeit of his visage in from Jamaica far. Made them stand up. Yeah. and made an express image of a king whom they honored to the end that they, by this their forwardness, they might flatter him that was absent as if he were present. Yeah, exactly, exactly.
Yeah, I seen girls twerking on men. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I seen that yeah. one too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. <laughs> This is um, Exodus 12 and 12, the precept. It says, For I will pass to the land of Egypt this night and will smite all the firstborn in the land of Egypt. Right, That's and right. that death angel that went through the land of Egypt was Yahweh's side. Mm -hmm. That's right. Both man and beast, and against all the gods of Egypt, I will execute judgment. Mm -hmm. I am the Lord Yahweh. He's going to come as, a, 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 as an angelic force to destroy all the idols, right? all the wickedness. Hey, Jake comes up, Jake's, a, Jake's drunk with idols. Jake, Jake's got a, a, a Kemet pendant. He's, yes. he's, he's got a Rastafarian hat on, yep. right? <laughs> he's a, a, a crucifix, he's burning candles. Yep. Yeah. Right? Yep. Jake's got it. Goofy yeah, on. Evil, evil. <laughs> yeah, right? Hey, look. His chain is the, the horns right. with the hand, the yeah. hand signal of the yeah. horns. Yeah. And he walks around throwing you up all the time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Right? Outside, that cloud is a chariot. What the world ignorantly calls ships, our lords are coming out of the skies with the hosts of heaven, right. and shall come into Egypt, right. America, spiritual side of spiritual Egypt, right. and the idols of Egypt shall be moved, right? By All idols, man, your Buddhas, your Kemets, mm -hmm. your Shiva Jatis, mm -hmm. right? Your Wiccans, your witches, your warlocks. Mm -hmm. Right, you guzzle all of that. Have right. you, you guys seen that one? It was, um, it was an Indian uh, party or something in the Kali. Like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Baby. Baby. Oh, the baby. Oh, the baby. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 And then you go in the combat and shit, like, you know, like, oh, like, like, you're saying the right thing, right? You're saying And then you have other people saying, oh, no, this is Kali, the mother, the mother God, the nurturer. Pass away bad energy in all worship, but you can look at it. It's cute, yeah. Right? It says, and shall so come into Egypt, and the idols of Egypt shall be moved at his presence. Melt. Right, because all the, uh, the return of our Lord, scripture says, Behold, he cometh with clouds. Mm -hmm. Right, and all, and, all, and all the people of the earth shall mourn. We're here, face. People are going to give up their spirit when they see the sky crack That's and the right. chariots and Yahweh shall come. That's right. Right. In the midst of it, and I will set against the Egyptians. Right, the, the Babylonian against Babylonian, American against American. And we see, we see the the, the, the prelude to that happening. Civil war, civil unrest. Mm -hmm. Right, there's a, there's a movie out. Uh, the trailer's out, Come. coming out next year, April. Yeah. Uh, civil war in America. Mm -hmm. Just to watch that. Yeah, civil war. Right. Right. Predictive program. All right. All right. That's like another 16. That's right. right. That's right. I was thinking about that coming down there. Right? Yeah. That's Pushing all these movies and they're showing them, but they're not even hiding. Right? They're showing them. Right? But you people are in such a stupor, you know, a spiritual drunken stupor that you don't care. The, the truth is, is in plain sight. Huh? That's a movie. Oh, that's a movie. Because <laughs> even in the movie, um, Leave the World Behind, the girl, all she wanted to do was watch her favorite sitcom. Right? Yeah. You know? Friends. You know, and that's a lot of you people. All you want to do is go back to normal. Yeah, they're delusional. Yeah, yeah. They're delusional. that's right. You know? That's yeah, they're it. Delusional. Right. And, uh, we're tired of that spirit, man. Right? Mm -hmm. You know, that's a weak spirit that you that you people are in. But you know, yeah, I put you in that, man. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Judge, man. Right? Yeah. You know, act like act like nothing's happening. That's right. right. Act like nothing's happening. Yeah, just like what? Do a marathon. You know. Everything's all good. The red door signifies when Yahweh said death angel was going going over in Egypt. And you put up the door, that red door was symbolic to that because she went into that door and she was safe. So everything was there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 All right, it says verse two. But sorry, brother. Um, you know the world leave. Uh, you know the movie leave the world behind. That's an actual oxymoron because if you, if you remember at the very beginning of the movie with Julia Roberts, 
she said she didn't like people and she actually wanted to get away from right. her life yep. and what she was doing currently. Yep. And that's why they wanted to go on a vacation. That's right. But <laughs> the world <laughs> left them behind. Or really, the Lord left them behind. That's right. And now how are you going to catch up? Exactly. And they didn't catch up. No. <laughs> so. Five, five, five. Two. I will set the Egyptians against the Egyptians, and they shall fight everyone against his brother, right. and everyone against his neighbor. Right. Class wars, civil unrest, uh, red versus blue. Mm -hmm. right. Republican against, okay, versus Democrat. That's right. Mm -hmm. Right. So-called black versus uh, uh, so-called white man. That's this right. was coming to the streets of America. Yeah, that's right. Right. Martial law is going to have to be enforced. That's right. Right. They're already putting out the narrative that uh, the, the the election may be postponed. Mm -hmm. Right, this, this 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 diabolical man, man, this wicked banking, he, he's 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 he, he's being he's being uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Calculative. He's setting up he's setting up his ducks in a row. That's right. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. City against city mm -hmm. and kingdom against kingdom, mm -hmm. and the spirit of Egypt shall fail mm -hmm. in the midst thereof. Right. right. And I will destroy the council thereof. And they shall seek to the idols. Right, uh, I shall destroy the council there. And they shall seek to the idols. These at least they pray to the left hand side. Right? They 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 they, they look at uh, astrology and sorcery. Mm -hmm. Right? The Lord is here saying he's gonna destroy that council. Right? He's gonna destroy their inner circle. Right? They're gonna be running and the scripture said the uh, the heavens shall be afraid, shall be in great fear. Right? The presidents, the, 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 these uh, modern day seasons, they're not gonna know what to, they're gonna be hiding in their bunkers. Hey, but that's what that statue in Bangladesh represents. That statue over there is them trying to attempt to keep back judgment. They're coming against us, man, and we feel it. We feel the spiritual attacks, man. So their 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 um witchcraft is turned up, and that's what that statue's over there for. You have a lot of brothers in, in this troop that live over there in Brampton. That's for you. For you brothers that live downtown, you have all the CN Tower and you have all of that. Right, so everywhere we are, they're gonna they're gonna be sending out heavy curses upon us, man. Those are curses, man. That's a curse. Just like when somebody gives you the peace sign, that's a curse. So that damn statue, you, you, you have to drive by that, which Every obviously day. you have to. You're gonna be looking up, seeing this fucking this damn demon. That's a curse, man. Mm -hmm. That's right. And, and, and there's Israelites that live in proximity to that statue. Yeah. You know, because that's a big monkey face thing, you know, <laughs> they can't do nothing about it. Huh? So how does how a Christian society, when you got another God, and not do Christianity, image, what is it, 50 feet tall? Yeah. 55 feet tall? Yeah. How's a Christian society? So-called Christian. Yeah. Right? So which means Christian is not what you think it means. The devil speaking. Mm -hmm. Right, they know Christian ain't no ain't, ain't, ain't the right thing. Right, but have the you, 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 you dumb mere mortals subscribing. Oh, Christian, right? But the word doesn't even mean what you think it means. All right, mm -hmm. the word Christian was refer, referring to Israel. Yeah, it's the one with the, the anointing with the oil. All right. This is uh, Revelation chapter thirteen, verse eleven. Going to your point, uh, and I beheld another beast coming up out of the earth. And he had two horns like a lamb, and he spake as a dragon. And he exerciseth all power of the first beast before him, and causes the earth and them which dwell therein to worship the first beast. So the first beast was the Roman Empire, right? Mm -hmm. It was now um, basically made on the end of the EU, right? I didn't mess up by saying EU, because they're EU, the yucky man, right? Okay, and it says, uh, and cause them and causes the earth and them which dwell therein to worship the first beast whose deadly wound was healed. And it, it, it healed by a mashak, man. Right, this this, this book is, is, a, is a story, man, well written, right? Nothing can out master the mastermind, mm -hmm. right? The most I made a nice movie, right? I woke us up and gave us what? Front seat to the destruction, right? The understanding, the secrets, okay? Uh, I just want to out because um, it had two horns like a lamb and it's big as a dragon. Those horns going into the, the, the political party system, which is uh, the Philippians, the partitions, and also you have Democrats and Republicans. And that's what you call a democracy. So so the reason why 
they use democracy as a front to make everything seem like it's okay mm -hmm. when really it's all rotten inside in, in their country. I mean, before they came here, they were like lambs. Mm -hmm. well, when they did come here, they were like a lamb because they came under the guise of Christianity. Mm -hmm. And then they, they actually stole this lamb under Christianity, right? But they still like to say that they're a Christian nation to this very day, but they're really not because they're bringing forth democracy. And now what does democracy bring? It brings inclusion. And that's why these heathens can come over here and set up and erect their idols. But really, that's really a curse onto you. And democracy isn't for us. It's not a perfect system. Because our Lord, he was killed by democracy when you go back into it. So you as an Israelite or Jake, you shouldn't, you shouldn't take part in democracy or buy into it. Right? That's why Daniel, Daniel 8, chapter 8, it says, Peace shall destroy That's a spirit, man. And that's why you have the Cohen's as well. The conservatives are... are, are uh, Democrats. Democrats. Mm -hmm. Republicans are red. Yes. And in Canada, it's liberal and conservative. That's what you see. Conservatives are blue. The liberals are red because the red represents energy. You know, it's not, you know, it's not, you know, it's violence as well. Mm -hmm. Different things, but it's more so out. But, but blue, that's why that color blue was so much used in that movie as well. Right, that, there's a video for that as well. Because blue is a very conservative color, makes people feel safe. Mm -hmm. You know, like, like everything's okay. And yep. like, you still live with more, right? Okay, laid back at the time. Mm -hmm. it's, all, it's all the same thing. That's why the two horns, it's a horn, it's a power. Right? It's, it's okay, this year, this 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 term we're going to use the Republicans. Okay, and then the next two terms we're going to use the de Democrats. Right? Because now everyone's crying for conservative here That's right. in Canada. <laughs> well, people forgot about Stephen Harper. Right? So it's always the same shit. That's right. You no, know, I'll bring back the liberals. <laughs> Isaiah 13, verse 14. And it shall be as a chaste robe and as a sheep that no man take the book. But even me, I even watching that movie a couple of days ago. Uh, okay. It shows you like a lot of deer, right? And it shows you basically that, uh, that basically, like these, even mice are gonna be, uh, like are gonna be like deers, man. like chase, like as a chase wolf. Right? And you shall be as a chase wolf, and as a sheep that no man take it up. They shall, it says, they shall every man turn to his own people, That's and right. every one to his own land. Mm -hmm. That's right. Every one that is found shall be thrust through, and every one that is joined. To, so you know, like that move that shows you that. Like civil war, right? so basically, like, 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 so they're showing you these things what's gonna happen. Oh, right, in the future. In that movie too, right? Yeah. The little girl when she was reading, she got in the boat. Remember, it said White House taken over yes. by rogue and worse forces. That's right, right. Which, which happened at the border. That's right. We have all these things about the French. We have all these things about the French. And then they said, um. Uh, they were talking about the um the radiation radio high radio and it shall be as a chase roll and as a man take it up they lead everyone into his own land that's why that's why the boy got sick Got yeah. Sick. Yes. His yeah. teeth started falling out. He got no. sick without radiation. That's why you grow you grow something in the mind. <laughs> I got mine. <laughs> Brothers already have herbs. We're not going to have herbs. We have herbs right now. He said, I don't us, But okay. we're already prepared with the truth. Yeah. And the truth allows you to prepare with things as well. Even if it's a fucking tent. Mm -hmm. Brothers, we, we just and we joke about uh, being homeless in that time. Mm -hmm. But that's not really a joke. That is a preparation, right? To have a sleeping bag or to have a tent. Right? Just like that next TV show that just came out. 
um, where he just travels with a damn toothbrush, man. That's all he travels with, just a toothbrush, right? Because he, he's, he's just a wanderer. He says that he's, a, he's, a, he's just a wanderer, but at the same time, sometimes that's how you're going to have to live, especially in the end, man. Mm -hmm. It's happening right now. Well, There's a whole also, bunch of people in well, he also he also say I'm useless because I don't have that on my phone. Yeah. So in that day, a lot of women, I'm gonna be fucking crying. That's right. Every, everyone that is found shall be thrust through, and everyone that is joined to them shall fall by the sword. That's right. Even in the movie, right? They, the, the girl told the father. Uh huh. But <laughs> Jake, he was in a bugged out state of mind, right? Like he's, he's buddy buddy, he's riding for the Edomite, he's, he's about yeah. to die for this Edomite. He's in tight with the, the white woman. You know? Yeah. Tight with yeah. fucking white woman. You know? That's an off spirit. You know? But they're trying to put that spirit on Jake that when all hell breaks loose, you know there's going to be some good Edomites. And, yeah. You know? We're gonna, we can band together. You know? Nah, man. They want your head, man. So, you know? Never trust that enemy. And their children also shall be dashed into pieces before their eyes. Their houses shall be spoiled, and their wives ravaged. Your house got spoiled. How do you mean? That's your house. But yeah, you're sleeping in the basement of your house. And these Edomites are just living life, right? You know? I know it's a movie, but still, you know? Yeah, come on. This is uh, Psalms chapter 2, verse 1. It says, Why do we eat and drink? And the people imagine they think the kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord, Yahweh Shemuel Shai, and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. Right, right now, you have to see the graves when they want to build up a 55 foot um, heathen uh, statue. Right? You know? What, 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 what? Boasted up your mind to even think to do that, man. The pride that came with that, man. You know, you think that you're never gonna fall. You think you, you know, because your trucking businesses is run going well, right? You get a lot of money. He starts giving you little kickbacks, right? He starts like, all right, we'll give you grabbing. You know, he starts like, fuck it, we'll give you grabbing. I don't give a fuck. No? <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> but <laughs> come on, man. That's that's the pride of you over a little city, man. <laughs> You know you get the free in your country just for one little part of the pocket of, of Ontario, right. man. You know? Yeah, because these Indians are over there in Vancouver, too. Right? Wait, 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 the Christians ain't even disputing it. I bet you I put a, a picture of Satan. Like what they deem as Satan? Yeah. Well, I say Satan. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So very true. So very true. Yeah. Which means that they don't do no God, research God, God, God. on nothing. So good point. Good fucking point. He says, yeah, verse four: He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord of hosts. I saw that he's laughing right now. Okay, right now they're raging with the uh, AI, the six G, yeah. yeah. mm -hmm. all these miracles. That's, yeah. On the, on the 
on the floor, it's nothing for them to get a, a um, to get you know shape up their beard and you know get a job, look good. And, and you, oh, you're one of us, brother. And you know they'll put them in position, man. You know. It says verse nine. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, all ye kings. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Serve the Lord Yahweh, blessed be Shai, with fear and rejoice with joy, and kiss the sun, lest he be angry and he perish from the night. When this, when his wrath is kindled, but a little, blessed are all they that put their trust in him. Blessed are they that put their trust in Yahweh, blessed be Yahweh, Shai, man. Okay, and a lot of the world, they they don't have any faith. In, in the higher power, right? That's right. That's in uh, Second Edges five. God. It says, "One man shall ask another his righteousness that maketh a man righteous gone through thee, and he shall say no." Hey, because remember, like um, Apostle Har made a comment uh, two weeks ago, three weeks ago, the highways. Our temptation, the whole part of temptation is that they're going to be cut out of society. Mm -hmm. They're going to be cut out from not taking the. M-A-R-K. Right? That's a temptation. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're not going to have any advantages. Right? You're not going to have fresh water. chapter 8 verse 23 and when he was entered into a ship his disciple followed him and behold there arose a great tempest in the sea insomuch that the ship was covered with the waves but he was asleep and his disciples came to him and awoke him saying Lord save us we perish and he saith unto them why are you why are you fearful O ye of little faith then he arose and rebuked the winds and the sea and there was a great calm but the men marveled saying what manner of man is this even the winds and the sea will be him. Right? So so there's yeah. levels to faith though. So that level, it's hard to reach that level. That's what you're right. saying is true, but there's levels to faith. The level that Yahushai was at. Because it's easy. Remember, we just passed round one. Round two is going to be another level. We don't know how many brothers are going to have that level of faith. And then M-R-A-K M -R -M -A -R -K level, we don't know who's going to have that level. Like these levels, man, it's just going to get harder and harder and harder, man. Right? Because you have to, hold on, Elder. You have to understand that the more a man moves, it's the harder to keep that. It's easy to be faithful when you have everything. It's easy, it's easy to be faithful when life is good. It's hard when everything is going bad, right? Because what did the woman say to Job? In your mind, you're just gonna be like, yeah, nah, fuck. Because this world is blessings with riches. So they, why don't I have anything? So then you faith that Job had, come on, man, deadly, or the level of faith that Yahushua had, 
deadly, man. This is Second Ezra's five and one. It says, nevertheless, as co as coming the tokens, behold, the day shall come that they which shall dwell upon the earth shall be taken in a great number, and the land shall be barren of faith. Hey, even let's go back to one of the disciples, man. No, two. We have two disciples that that, that, that are afraid. You have uh, uh, Judas and you have Peter, man. Peter lost faith. Peter wasn't as high. <laughs> that, was that was just an exact. Before that, you say, look, I'm ready to die. Yeah, I'm ready to die. Right I'm ready to die. Right 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 I got your back, Lord. Let me just <laughs> this is the last verse, verse 2. But iniquity shall be more than thou hast heard long ago. That's what we're into right now. Okay, this is uh, Matthew chapter 26, verse 34. Yahweh, I said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, that this night before the cock crows, thou shalt deny me thrice. Peter said unto him, Though I should die with thee, yet will I not deny thee. Like also said all the disciples. That's why we can't be uh, proud, man. Because exactly. You don't know, man. Exactly. You could say it, or you could think it, believe it, have faith. You know, but you just don't know what's gonna happen, man. That's that's why the most important thing is to be humble and pray. That's it. Hey, hey, just like how it said, it feels good to say. Tummy is full. Mm -hmm. Right. You got a warm bed, right? You got internet. Yeah. You know, but. That's why, that's the example, brothers have to say, pray, pray to the Lord and say, look, Lord, during that time, I'll give you the spirit to the Lord. Right. right? And there's different prayers you can say, but pretty much, you know, you don't know what the hell's going to happen. No. 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 Just like, just like I didn't know I was going to be here teaching. Nope. None of us knew. Nope. No. Right? Look, look where we are now. From, no. from your birth. Right? From your adolescence. Real. You don't know what the hell's going to happen. Real. So, so more than six. Real. And, and that scripture goes into the movie as well because what happened is that he was sitting down with the woman and he was talking about the, the, the top guy that he knew and he's just like oh yeah well, I'm a part of some evil cabal. Right. Da, 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 da. Yeah, and then um, when he got the call from his friend, he's like, yo, I need you to move around some money. And he's just like, yo, take care. And um, that's what's going to happen. And all you little people, all you cops, you military, and I, obviously a lot of the military is going to be okay. I'm not talking about you. You little yes. small guys, you're done. Mm -hmm. But you, you, you mayors, detectives, uh, they're nobodies. Constables. They're nobodies. <laughs> they're not going to get the call. No. They ain't going to get the call. So you're going to be left down here with all the people, uh -huh. all the hungry beasts. Uh -huh. And they're going to be like, oh, you're here with us? Oh, hi. <laughs> the man say, take care of yourself. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the man said, take care of myself. <laughs> <laughs> the man had a phone. You know, phone was supposed to set up. The satellite. The satellite. didn't work. Oh, exactly. God. So, so, so you, in his, his mind, he's good. Yeah, yeah. He's back in his house. And yeah. Up, went there, it didn't work. Exactly. So, I'm going to show you that. That's right. What's up, The most has to be with you that day. That's right. right. And, 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 God. Oh, they yeah. had all that shit, God. and then another, another person. They were probably stuck <laughs> in the city. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> that? no, that's, <laughs> but that's what we told them about <laughs> the, the Kardashians. Remember the Teslas? Remember the Teslas? Yeah. The whole line of Teslas. Garbage. 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 Yeah. You know? We got caught in traffic. Good. Yeah. It, it, it was like yeah. miles long, too. It was miles yeah. long in traffic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. yeah, you can yeah. go ahead. Yeah, they kept coming. <laughs> God, yeah, that's, that's crazy. So, 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 so
I'm going to say real quick. Pardon? In the movie World War Z. Yes. Yes. Yes, yeah, there's a cop. There's a scene where a oh, yeah, guy yeah. was in the grocery store, and the cop was in there too. And he thought he had a because everybody was taking stuff. Yeah, yeah. And the cop just walked past him yeah, and sniped him. Yeah. Take the, yeah. You, get you know? You need a baby. You need a baby on your life. These <laughs> cops are not getting the call, man. No, they're not getting the call. Nope. No. They, they have, have a, a list. Remember, they have a list. Just like 9-11, they had a list. Yo, exactly. Hello? No, not today. Exactly. <laughs> not today. You know? All right, sorry. Sorry. Hey, that happened in the movie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, you go they out. were desiring. Yeah. Because yeah. Jeepers is working, he left yeah, yeah, yeah. and came back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And freaking idiot opened back the door. Yeah. I wouldn't. Yeah. Even the girl said, "Why you open the door? Why, why you let the man?" <laughs> These people don't know their left from their right. They don't know east or west. <laughs> That's right? right. They don't have no sense of direction. They have this, you know. Up to six G. That's the only way they're gonna know how to get home, man. Yeah. Or through the Uber ride, the Uber app. You know. <laughs> hey, Issa, have us a stupor, man. Like, yeah. <laughs> hey. I don't know where I'm going either. You know what I mean? So you trust the most high. Because everybody trusted them, the Google map thing and the ways. Yeah. You know? Like that specific scene. Yeah. I'm used this. I'm used this. Yeah. The Obama's produced that. Yeah. It shows you, hey, this is the average person. This is the average man. Done. Yeah. That's Homer Simpson. Yeah. That's Homer Simpson and yeah. the next guy, uh, Peter, Peter Griffin. Griffin. Yeah. <laughs> That's Peter Griffin. But uh, one one thing that was mentioned though, when the guy was talking about, um, because he's a lawyer, right? And he was talking about the guy who was a part of the evil cabal. Mm. He also mentioned that the guy that was a part of the evil cabal told him that every year it's around the winter solstice <laughs> yeah. that he gets yeah. the information yes. from this cabal. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. But the thing is, even though that guy has the information, that information is not really to save you. It's just to allow you to anticipate. Yes. But that doesn't mean you're going to get away scot-free. And that's yeah. what the elites are just doing. Mm -hmm. They just have the information to anticipate the yeah. destruction, but they're not going to get away. And he said that in the movie. Yes. Right? Sorry. No, I just said they have the foreknowledge. And that's what apostles are saying. They watch our videos, man. The apostles, they watch the videos, man. So they can get the insight. Okay, what's going to really happen? And then, and then guess what? When the internet cuts off, that's why it says they shall bring you to their... Uh, the gates of their nobles. Yeah. Hey, because remember, the, 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 the elites, their live stream or their creation is to the spiritual world. So when the Most High turns that off and the demons stop answering them, they won't know where to go either. Their, their, their spiritual GPS is going to be turned off and yeah. ours is going to be turned on. Right. It's on that, high. That, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, let them help you now. Yeah. Uh, for because of their pride, the city shall be troubled. Mm -hmm. The houses shall be destroyed. The man shall be afraid. A man shall have no beauty upon his knife. Yeah. Upon his neighbor. Hey, hey, pride, 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 is like a, pride is a virus, man. Yeah. Yeah. Pride is a virus that pretty much infected the entire world. That's right. right. That's why it says, when the Lord comes, all the mean man shall be humble, right? Uh, uh, the people shall be uh, the humility. The strong men right? shall be like women. That's right. Mm -hmm. Because everybody, man, down to the 300 pound gargoyle bitch, right, that thinks she's something, everybody's <laughs> proud. Mm -hmm. Everyone she's thinks the they're, she, they're the hot shit, you know? You can't tell them, you can't <laughs> prove anybody. Nope. Everything's just, fuck it. Yeah. Big Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> Big Shirley's gonna lose. Weight. Big Shirley's gonna feel it that day. Big Shirley's gonna lose. Big Shirley's gonna lose. Big movie, when the man says, the man see the, see the man son in the back of the car, like, Fold it up. Oh, yeah, 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 and I yeah, said, yeah. I need it. Yeah, man. <laughs> you know me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know me. You're pretty, man. Right? Yeah, I hope you. And the money, they, you know, a thousand bucks for, for, for some, 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 some damn painkiller. Like, it's a lot. They don't want the money. Yeah, right? they, they said something about the bar. Something, but how did it go? Basically, every. Uh, uh, 
scenario where money stops spinning out of the banking machines and he told them that's why you got to give us the banking bail they did a movie on it which is the wall street and it, that was very well done because they went to the government and scared the government that chaos in the streets <laughs> was it true That's how yep. you know the movie wasn't prophetic, right? The movie was good, but it wasn't prophetic. It didn't show that part because they wouldn't be buddy buddy. As soon as that guy saw them driving on this land, boom, 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 boom. Yeah. The car would have. Yeah. He wouldn't have come to them and tell them, "Oh, well, this you guys got to go prepare." No, you would kill them because <laughs> you know why you would kill them? Because you came to my house. You know I'm here. You know I have supplies, so when you get desperate, you're coming back. Yeah. So why wouldn't I just kill you now? Right. Yeah, you should have just killed them. <laughs> they, they, you have the girl, the husband. Right, because I don't know what man is going to see that, that, that kind of situation. Like the girls are, get in the fucking car. And you go, oh, you drive. <laughs> that bitch move. I want to, you know, I'm driving. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> she was the man in the movie. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, and that's why in the Middle East you can't drive either. Because driving is a position of power. Mm -hmm. Right? That means that you're when somebody says you're she got in she's in control mm -hmm. right and women are not supposed to have that level of control because when you drive you can go from place to place right so in the middle east they don't give women that level of power that's too much power for a woman Ecclesiastes 12 and 1 remember while the evil day come not that's right no when thou shalt say, I have no pleasure in them. That's right. While the sun or the light or the moon or the stars be not darkened, nor the clouds return after the rain, in the days when the key of the destruction shall bother the clouds is returning at the rain right now because the rain is raining, right? All you tender plants, it got, it got into us, right? But, 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 but the cloud is going back, man. When the truth is going to be, it's going to be withdrawn from the earth. Mm -hmm. Right, you want me to, to, to turn the TV on and see the prophets? Mm -hmm. Right, yeah. you know, like, ah, the guys, I can't stand them guys. <laughs> right, I did. <laughs> All right, you're gonna have no internet, no power. The day when the people of the house shall tremble and the strong men shall bow themselves and the grinders cease because they are few, and those that look out the windows be darkened. And the door shall be shut. Not in not one, man, not, not one. <laughs> and and, and that, that's that's real alert. That means Jake's about to do something stupid. Yeah. Exactly. Right? Not not one. Mm -hmm. Right? <laughs> in the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble, and the strong men shall bow themselves, and the grinders shall be their feet, and those that look out the windows be darkened. In the streets, when the sound of grinding is low, and 
shall rise up with the voice of a bird, and the dogs and music shall be brought low. Hey, and that's why they have in the movie they showed you the weapon that they were using on the people mm -hmm. that's why they have that weapon because they know the majority of you people are going to turn against the government but they have a sound weapon whatever sound weapon they were using hypersonic mm -hmm. that could mush up your eardrums man mm -hmm. and when they shall be afraid of the sound of the night and when they shall be afraid of them which is high and fear shall be in the way that the almond tree shall flourish and the grasshoppers shall be a burden and and desire shall fail because a man goeth to his long home and the mourners go about the streets all right so even right now the whole thing with the whole uh israel the state of israel versus palestine you know it's, it's true enough right now Palestinian flag, all right? So it shows you, man. Yeah. And uh, and that and every and and every silver gold, sorry, and every silver cord be loose, and the golden balls be broken. This is uh, Isaiah chapter forty-seven. Verse, verse 11, Therefore shall evil come upon thee, thou shalt not know from whence it rises, and mischief That's right. shall fall upon thee. That's right. Thou shalt not be able to put it off, That's right. and desolation shall come upon thee, which thou shalt not know. Stand now with thy enchantments, and with the multitude of thy sorceries, wherein thou hast labored from thy youth. That's right. If so be thou, shall be able to profit. That's right. If so be, thou mayest prevail. Yeah, these things are so good unto you. Let's see if we're going to um, stand the chance against the Ha'ba Shem Yal Shai. Against the power of the Ha'ba Shem Yal Shai, man. Okay? The Lord's going to put these idols to the test. Man. And like we said, they're no gods. All right? We've already read that these idols are nothing, man. Okay? The Lord is the one that set it up for the kingdoms, man. He sets up nations and people who are whether, the, whether these heathens want to uh, believe the most I set them up or not, who cares? Okay? The Israelites know who set, who set up, right? the elect of Israel, we know. Okay? Right? Verse 13, Thou art wearied in the multitude of thy counsels. Let now the astrologers, the stargazers, mm -hmm. the monthly prognosticators, mm -hmm. stop up and save thee from these things that shall come upon and thee. That's right. All these people are everywhere, man. Right? All these people are witches and warlocks, man. Right? That's right. Okay? All they, they have little shrines, whatever. They do uh, black magic, whatever. White magic. Whatever you, you name it, man. Right? That's astrology. You know? So let's see if all that stuff can be seen in that day, man. You know? All right? Behold, they shall be as stubble. The fire shall burn them. They shall not deliver themselves. You're gonna be stuck. You're gonna realize your power source is, is not is um is nothing, man. Gwindoli. Okay? And you're gonna realize it was all fate. You know? Go ahead. There shall not be a coal to warm at, no fire to sit before it. Thus shall they be unto thee with whom thou hast labored, even thy merchants from thy youth. They shall wander everyone yeah. to his quarter. None shall uh, save thee. Other than that. We got something else. This is, uh, this is James 5 and 1. Go to now, ye rich men, weep and howl for your miseries that shall come upon you. Your riches are corrupted and your garments are moth eaten. Mm -hmm. Your gold yeah, and how silver. Do they get these huh? You gotta do rape, robbery, and murder. Right. So anything gotten by those means, it's going to be corrupted, right? right. You know, there's not, it's not blessed. Okay, the land that you are on is polluted right now, right? Yeah. yeah, so, okay, you have the fatness of the earth, but it's polluted. Mm -hmm. Okay, you destroy the, the earth that you live on, right? <laughs> the air that you breathe, you're destroyed. Right? 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 Uh, verse 2, your rich corrupted. And your moth garments are moth-eaten. Mm -hmm. Your gold and silver, 
and the rust of them shall be a witness against you, and shall eat your flesh as it were fire. Hey, and, and what righteous man would would set up a world where you have nuclear weapons? If you're gonna lose power, you're gonna lose power. Why destroy the thing that gave you rulership? You know what I mean? Like even the most high, even though the most high gave you rulership, but it's the earth where you're gonna get that all that blessing because the earth is heaven as well, right? It's heaven on earth. So why would you destroy that? That means that you're not right. That means you weren't supposed to be in rulership in the fucking first place, man. Because you're willing to destroy it. You destroy it all, man. You're a fucking bunch of wicked ass people, man. Whatever is going on over there in the Middle East, we're not going to mention any names. Ain't none of that righteous, man. That's all wickedness, man. Blowing things to smithereens. That's all wickedness, man. Mm -hmm. Back in the day when, when men went to war, men killed each other. You'd yeah. see men on the battlefield men, dead. Yeah, that's right. mm -hmm. Exactly. You know? The, the, the damage was not as as great of scale as how it is now, man. You guys are and destroying it's waters. Yeah, it's it's yeah, yeah, yeah. Carnage, yeah. Carnage, Carnage, bro. Carnage. Carnage. Son of perdition. Yeah. Right? And then, and then on top of that, now he, he's setting his eyes on to the universe to get, escape from all the bullshit that he's already done on this earth. Right? Go to the moon and Mars and all this shit. You know? That's his plans, but you know. Look what happened over there in, in, in Japan. Right. They, look how long their water system and all of that. They, they, their, their, their crops couldn't even grow. That shit was all polluted, man. Well, remember the reactor that went off over there? Fukushima. Still, yeah, that's leaking, right, man. It's still leaking shit. Yeah. Disgusting, man. And, we're, right, man. and that's in our food. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. in our food right now. All. Yeah. Anything, man. Well, you saw the fishes are beast yeah. themselves. No, a lot yeah. of fishes. Oh, no, what causes that? Come on, man. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> what, what could that be? <laughs> With three eyes. Do <laughs> <laughs> you have more? Yes, sir. <laughs> a little bit more. Um... Says your gold and silver is cankered, and the rust of them shall be a <coughs> You shall eat it, your, your flesh, as it were fire. You have heaped treasures together for the last days. Mm. That's going into the elites, the secret council of the wicked. Mm -hmm. uh, Psalm 64 okay. chapter. That's right. Because they are the ones that are behind everything. They're, they're controlling things. They're the unseen hand. You know, they own uh, the, the monetary fund. Mm -hmm. IMF, they own uh, uh, the own. Uh, Federal Reserve, that's right, the bank, coupons, the Gettys, they own all of it, right? It's not even going into why it says your silver and your gold is cankered. It's not even silver gold, right? It's fabricated money. It's not even money, right? It's a bank. Right, so even the Federal Reserve, that, that was an illegal, that was an illegal move, actually. That, that's actually illegal to, to, to establish something like that. Usury, you know, uh, usury. Right. Um, um, then, then Nixon, I think in the seven seventy one, I think he took it off fully gold yeah. standard. Right. So your dollar is back backwards, man. Not back by anything. Yeah, that's true. It says uh, riches are translated from one uh, kingdom to another. I believe that's a precept because that's what it says. Uh, you have heap treasures together for the last days. Mm -hmm. You know, you've actually heaped all those treasures up to give it to Israel. That's right. The thing is, you don't know what to do with it. You just have to hold it. We're going to have the knowledge to put it to use. Don't uplift the, the vibration of this earth, right? Mm. Store it up like a <laughs> medium. <laughs> you know? Like a medium. All right, give, give it a day. Oh, it's just the doors just for a chain, you know? Yeah, it's not that, right? But that's the, that's the pinnacle of... Take his ribs. Like, you know, there's a rib. Come on, man. It, it, it's, it can be like, gold is a serious bones, man. Like, so it can power things, man. Mm. Knowledge in the kingdom, man. They found, they found um, I put up an art in the chat. They found pretty much crystals in your pineal gland, right? And they're primarily uh, they're made of carbon, oxygen, and calcium. It's very small, it's a very small amount, but that shows you what the pinot that is about. Right? And this is uh, Isaiah 10 and 13. It says, For he, for he said, Behold, I will make the earth and the heavens and the sea and the mountains 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 and
and by my wisdom, for I am prudent, and I have removed the bounds of the people. And because he has all these top universities and stuff like that, and he does this quote unquote diligent search, so he thinks he's the guy, right? That that's done it. That he's on top. He has the knowledge. If you want to get any knowledge, you got to go to him. Right? Hey, but let me ask you, who removed the bounds of the people? Which other nation removed the bounds that's of the people? True. You know, this man actually conquered continents, changed border lines, changed names of countries and places. Fine. They, they call yeah. their names after the, the land after their, their name. Fine. He set the borders, right? Yeah, yeah. So that I've removed the bounds of the people and have robbed their treasure. And I have put down the inhabitants like a valiant man. Mm. Uh, this is Esau speaking in his spirit, man. Yeah, I've done this. Yeah. That's what he's doing. Right? Yeah, this is how he feels. Right? Hey man, all this shit they're getting away with, like Epstein, right? He's just a guy that just went, just flicked him. You know, just flicked him, man. You know, he, he's at the bottom, man. They just flicked him, like lint. Right? They just said, okay, you know what? He's a scapegoat. So imagine how much other things that they're doing that you don't even know about. Right? And they feel proud in it. Yeah, we're, we're, we're child ever, man. Wicked, man. Verse 14. And this is the point. And my hand hath found as a nest the riches of the people. And as one gathereth eggs that are left, have I gathered all the earth. And there was none that moved the wing or opened the mouth or peeped. Uh, Isaiah, Isaiah 54, verse 16. Behold, I have created a smith that bloweth the coals in the fire, and that bringeth forth an instrument for his work. And I've created a way to, to destroy it. So you can, uh, and the whole, the whole technology that was inspired by the Heavenly Father. That's right. So everything that's happening right now is the Heavenly Father's uh, story. No weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper, and every tongue that shall rise up against thee in judgment thou shalt condemn. This is the heritage of the servant of the Lord, and the righteousness is of me, Job 27, uh, verse 16. Though he heap up silver as the dust, and prepare rain as the clay, he may prepare it, but the just shall put it on, and the innocent shall divide the silver. Just to be able to put it to use, man, for the, for the righteous, for the righteousness, man. Like I said, to liberate the earth, to benefit the earth, okay? Because he's just keeping it all up. Like I said, you don't even know what to do with it. He's just like, you know, guy, he just wants it all. Oh, I found this uh, gold reserve in, in South America somewhere. I need to, I need to uh, set up, uh, facility over there to extract it. So even right here. here. There's a place right here in Canada. Ontario, northern Ontario, it's called the Ring of Fire. Yeah. Right? right? And, and, and within that premise, they have gold, silver, platinum, copper. So I was watching I was watching that documentary with Idris uh, Elba. First with documentary about gold. Jamaica, and, and, and they offer to give Jamaica government 5%. 5%. 5%. Easily.
so this is uh, Genesis chapter 2. There's, um, there's man, and I'm going to jump down to 15, okay? It says, man, whoever went out of Eden, parted, and from thence it was parted, and it became into four heads, and the name of the oh, first is Pison, that is, it is a path of the whole land of Havilah, where there is gold, and all of that land is good. Second river is Gihon, the same is that the path of the whole land of Ethiopia. And the name of the third river is Picadel, that it is which goeth toward the east of Assyria, but the fourth river is Euphrates. And the Lord took the man Adam and put him into the garden of Eden to dress it and to keep it. And I believe uh, when you go into the word dress, it just simply means it only goes back to the Greek priesthood, the biblical rites is you to be a priest and you were given laws such and commandments to keep the land and to worship the Lord. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're going to be doing in the kingdom. And it just shows you that this guy, this devil, he's not a high priest. Nope. Because what is he doing with the gold? All the resources. He's using it for evil. <laughs> right? He's supposed to dress the earth. Yeah. Jeremiah 17 verse 11. As the partridge sitteth on eggs and hatcheth them not, so he that getteth riches and not by rights shall leave them in the midst of his days, and at his end shall be a fool. That's right, because you know, all things, he's going to have to abandon shit pretty much. He's going to have to abandon all his different uh, mining facilities, man. Right? Yeah. He's going to have to go, yeah. He's just going right from the ground. You know, the men that are working in these places, they're not going to be extracting gold. They're going to be thinking about survival, man. Mm -hmm. All right? Isaiah 13 and verse 12. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir. Read that part again. Uh, I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir. That's right, man. In this world, man, they, what it really means to be a man, the importance of a man, okay? But the Lord is going to bring that back. And that's talking about uh, the Israelite man, the elect that's right. Israelite man. Yeah. <clears throat> the Lord is going to make the elect Israelite man more precious than fine gold. Mm -hmm. So here it is, we're harping on gold right now, but he's going to make a man, an Israelite man, the elect Israelite man, more precious than gold. Man. Mm -hmm. okay? That's what's to come. If you're going to see the, see us and know this good gold, those are the children of God, those are the sons of God. Mm -hmm. We're going to be yo, we're, we're going to shine. We're going to be shine. on a level where if you watch that movie uh, with uh, John Travolta, where he, was, he had the dreads, yeah, yes, yes. We're gonna be on that level where even higher because they're gonna we're gonna be God's people. Right? We're gonna be on that level. Right? So we're gonna have technology that's different, right? We're gonna be in their little stone and actual thing, but we're gonna be able to be I will make a man more precious than fine gold than measurable earth. And the earth shall be removed out of her place in the wrath of the Lord of hosts and in the day of his, of his fierce anger. It's nothing for the Lord to create it, man. You know, it's nothing for the Lord to, because all these things are created in the heavens anyways, man. It could be sent down, man. It's like 87% Right, it's actually stone, right? You know? Exodus 12, verse 35. It says, The children of Israel, 
it according to the word of Moses and they borrowed it from the Egyptians, the Jews of Syria, and the Jews of God and Raymond. shall be built up with sapphire and emeralds and precious stones. Mm -hmm. They it's a dire wall and tower and Where is that right now? Where these guys are in the land. You don't have to see that a people for the Where is that then? You know? This is the prophecy that has a couple of right? But yeah, you guys are the people though, right? What do you get it? Towers and battlements with pure gold, and the streets of Jerusalem shall be paved oh, you're the with girls. Yeah, there it is. The tabernacle and the stones of Ophir. And all the streets shall say Hallelujah. It's not gonna look like this shit. This is nasty. Every every year after all. Yeah. 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 You don't have to touch your feet. Fuck up your knees. The roads and all that under construction. Highway 401. Uh, I hit a, I hit a, I hit a, 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 a,
after the number of the tribes of Israel. He set a crown of gold upon the bee trees, wherein was engraved holiness, an ornament of honor, a costly word, the desires of the eyes, goodly and beautiful. Before him there were none such before him there were none such. Neither did ever any stranger put them on, but only his children and his children's children perpetually. And that just goes into, you know, the Lord, you know, like they, they got these movies that are Bible and the Asian world, and they kind of like look like fun, man. You know, they look raggedy now, but the Lord, he likes to uh, spiff you up, man. Right? Beautify you, right? He's a stylist, right? So all that I read right now, we're going to have even way better. Because it says he's gonna do better for us uh, than the beginning, right? Which is Eden, right? He's gonna be he's gonna do better for us in the end than in the beginning. Right, that's right. <laughs> oh, counterfeit money. The money is counterfeit. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They shall cast their silver in the streets, and their gold shall be removed. Their silver and their gold shall not be able to deliver them in the day of the wrath of the Lord. It's like your bitcoins, man. You know, those, those memory stick, you, you download the thing, I got this, I got bitcoins, you know? <laughs> well, you, yeah, God. God. Yeah. Cold storage. Cold storage. Yeah, yeah. 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 See, the, the, those are the clips. And those, the work on the end. You got this. Listen, man, it won't save you, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if gold won't we'll save you, then <laughs> damn sure Bitcoin ain't gonna save you. Hey, you know what could, is that what could do? Turn, turn, off, turn off the computer. The it's done. The, the lead. Where do you want to call? Where are you going to tap? Where are you going to tap the phone? Where are you going to tap the phone? Where are you going to tap the phone? In those days, there's no internet. There's no power. Exactly. That's all. They throw the sky and all that stuff. That's not fair. Hey, that's why, um, that's why when I first came to this truth and I learned about money, I loved it. And the history of money is that anything can be money. Right? They used to, tulips used to be money. You know what a fucking <laughs> That used to be currency, man. So anything could be currency. Salt. Salt, salt. Was, yeah. salt, salt yeah. was a really good uh, oh, currency. Yeah. That's right. Time. Time. Right? That was your salad. Salad. Salt. Salt. <laughs> in South America, it used to be corn. Corn was very expensive in South America, man. That was a trading tool. It was corn. It says, they, they shall not satisfy their souls, neither fill their bowls. Yeah, because because, because even look, you got a you got an ounce of gold in that time. You're gonna you're gonna enter a state of disparity where gold. You're gonna look at it like each only. Oh, what, 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 what am I gonna do with this? I need water. <laughs> you know? Fuck! I need bread. I need a can of something. I need Shit. something. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It says, Because it is the stubborn blood of the enemy. There's a scene in uh, the movie I Am Legend uh, where Will Smith is yeah, in the second one. Yeah, they're in the second one. Yeah, they're in the no way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. There's a scene where Will Smith is in a warehouse 
Oh, money. yeah. And he looks on the ground. Money. And look what money is. And he grabs back some money. And just, yeah. money just on the ground. Like, son. Right. That's going to keep you warm. Thing is, there's cars. Yeah. <laughs> you know, there's cars. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> right. And yeah, because that happened during the... Uh, uh, because um, that happened during on the, on, on, on the Weimar Republic, um, I think in the 1940s and 1930s. Germany. Yeah. Germany? Yeah. Yeah, that was 1940. Yeah, 20s, yeah. Let me jump off a little bit more. This is first one. It says, they have blown the trumpet even to make already, but not going to the battle. For my wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. The sword is without, and the pestilence and the famine within. The sword, the sword is without, and the pestilence and famine within. So out there in the sticks, the 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 the, 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 the bush where 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 where, 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 where uh, Esau has his trailers, right? And and, and the city and, and within that's the cities, right? Mm -hmm. The cities are gonna be a zoo, right? It's gonna be madness out here, man, right? Uh, so those oil barrels up with, with bonfires, right? Uh, with uh, uh, Jake or Esau and lawn chairs with guns. Where are you going? State your business. Right? He shall die with the sword. Are corrupted and your garments are mocked. Okay. It's okay. And uh, it's and your gold and silver is cankered, and the rust of them shall be a witness against you, and they shall eat up your flesh as it were fire. Yeah, how did you obtain those things, man? Okay, yeah, you have the gold, but how did you obtain it? Uh -huh. Why is it going to be a witness against you? Okay, that's going to show that you're guilty, man, right? because you brought these things, right? you stole in these resources. Right? You want to go into how he might have pretty much came into wealth. Let's look into uh, the sugar the sugar cane, right? Mm -hmm. They made they bank off of that in the Caribbean, right? Going back to the uh you know just before to Liverpool in the UK, right? They were making a whole ton of money, man. Yeah, man, it's serious. Like just any little piece of you know, pie and whatever, and that's just one trade, right? In sugar. Yeah, same crime. Yeah, different reasons. No, even the wineries, like in these, like in these Niagara and all over Canada, 
it's all like it's all of, it's our people doing all the hard physical labor and they're getting like uh, you know a basically a like abused and stuff. So, Because it takes time for these uh, these uh, grapes to produce God. for it to turn into wine, right? So what are they doing in the meantime? They gotta be making money in the meantime. They're, yep. not, they're not reaping the reward right away, right? So this that's show you the rich, the wealth that these Edomites have, these elites mm -hmm. of Esau Edom they have, man. Right? You know, there's no Jake owning no wild cows. That's a that's a losing business, man. Right? If you if you want to start a winery, man. Farming, you're not going to make a profit in the beginning, man. It's going to take some time. Yeah, it's, like, it's the same thing in uh, South America. Right? When you see these these tequila companies, the majority of them are named not because it's a not it's a company that's owned by like a, a mobster, not a mobster, the cartels or something like that. It's a don don this, don that, some top guy, guys who've been making one for years. You know? They can afford that. They can afford. They can take. Yeah, they can take the loss to get it in the future. Huh? Yeah, because even Niagara, right? Shit, there's a thing called organized crime winery. Yeah. Right? Like on the other side, organized crime winery. Every time I drive by, it's like that. And, and, and they have all kinds of different organized crime wineries. Wow. Right? So, yeah. So these things are backed by um, ill-gotten gains. You have heap treasures. You have heap. You have heap treasures together for the last days. You have here the laborers who have ripped down their fields, which is up kept back by fraud, pride, and the, and the pride of them, which have reaped are entered into the into the doors of the Sabaoth. Yeah, and the fraud today is the money. Something that's really robbing you because there's no value in it. They're giving you something, but they're the ones really gaining. You don't gain anything, it's actually not a fair exchange. That's what a barter system, system is. This is not a barter system. The money that we're getting is actually less valuable than what you're giving. You people have given 30, 40 years to jobs, and then they give you a watch. Hey, thank you. That's not a fair exchange, man. Right? Yeah, and the way you're getting right now is speed of value. That's not a fair exchange. They said uh, by the time next year, 24, they said uh, groceries are going up by $17. Yeah. Right? Bro, I was going to buy a cup of chocolate, right? <laughs> and I uh, don't you buy it. No, no, it's like, it's like, it's like 70% uh, chocolate. Yeah, yeah. Cacao. Yeah. 80% uh, Walmart, right? And then it's normally like when you buy three of them, it's like $5. Yeah, I just put that shit back. <laughs> you know, because you know, because I, because I put some of that in my smoothies and stuff, right? I'm like, yo, that shit's expensive, man. I'm not gonna buy three for something. Like a juice, you can buy like a big juice, seven dollars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and these yeah, middle class Edomites. I'm going to buy from my uh, nephews. <laughs> yeah. and, and these middle class Edomites, they're not ready for this, man. No, Jake's no, always. No, right? Yeah, they're all breaking down crying on TikTok, man. They're Jake's balling. Right. You saw a ball. J Jake's, you said no. Imagine no. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. You live in pleasure on the earth and been wanted. And you have nourished your heart, and as in, as in the day of slaughter. And these suburban, these these Edomites of suburbia, <laughs> these suburban e Edomites yes. with boat with boats in their driveways. Yep. Right, they got boats and trailers, trailers up in Kawartha yep. Lakes, yep. and yep. they're still a bar. Right. My cottage, <laughs> they're still my bar. cottage. Yep. <laughs> right now, they're they're trying to get rid of the cottage right now. It's a big thing right now. That they're trying to get rid of it and because it's becoming a liability in this time. Right. Good thing right? It would have burned down things on purpose now. Yes, he's man room. Yes, <laughs> yes. Burn yes. things yep. down, right? It's on the rise. Yeah, it's on the rise. <laughs> <laughs> All these apartments sure. that they invested in. Gun. Yep. You got no money. Exactly. Yeah, because they're cars to it. Yep. Grinding is ceasing.
grinding a season. You know, party time's over. He <laughs> have condemned and killed the trust, and he doth not, and he doth not, uh, and he doth not resist. Be patient, therefore, brethren, unto the un, unto the coming of the Lord. Behold, the husbandman waiteth for the. It said, for the husbandman waiteth for the precious fruit of the earth, and have long patience for it, until he receive the earth and rather rain. I'm shy. I can see the precious fruit. Also patient. patiently waiting, man, because he wants to get his revenge too, man. He forgot about how he got crucified, man. Okay, how they dealt with him, man. How up to third. Okay. He said, be you patient. So it's like it. Be patient. I mean, we got to be patient, man. Though, man. We got to wait, man. You know, we can't just be done, you know. We can't break, right? You right. know? Yeah, we go through stuff, but we got, this is part of our we gotta go trust, through. man. <coughs> well, we gotta go through just like you have a shine. Be patient. Uh, the other uh, Dallas Ariel is made a good lesson on that. He said, we're gonna be inwardly agitated. Yeah. And it's true. Right. You know, it's gonna be a thing where you're boxed in and you're gonna have to defend on your own Exactly. Yeah, your own side. That's it. You know, like you might look towards a brother. And that's a spirit on you. You gotta defend on your own Exactly. You know? Exactly. Because you're, you're, you're in a. You're that's a boxy win, and there's no remedy. That's right. There's, there's no uh, seeing remedy. There's None. nothing you can do. You're not going to go to a therapist, oh, I got problems. I've got problems. You know what? This person is not, bro. You got to deal with it in the spirit. Bro. That's right. Yeah. And the Lord yep. can pull you out. Or... That's why he's going to King of Tech. Mm -hmm. You know? Right? So be patient and establish your heart for the coming of the Lord to our night. Grudge not one another, I said, grudge not one another, brethren. It's unless he condemn, it's a, behold, the judge standeth, I said, the judge stand before the door. Take my brethren, I said, take my brethren, prophets. Saved, you need to know the Lord's name, man. All right? For an example of suffering, affliction, and patience. This is what it says the name of the Lord. Right? And this is the righteous word into it. This is the seek of protection. Okay, so that name, the name there goes into that reputation. Right? So, so you, you must know why, right? And, and, and the value. Because how did, how did most of Israelites, so called Israelites, Right, because it's not all Israel. It's not all Israel that was of Israel, right? How did they find the truth? Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nate says no. Nobody has broken him down like how he has broken it down to date. He said that. Mm -hmm. So why aren't you calling? Why, why aren't you calling the name that you broke down so eloquently? Yep. Right. Let's believe. Let's believe that you can pay it up. The name is very reputable, right? And it has a reputation attached to it, man. Said, behold, we, we count themselves. It said, and behold, we count them happy, which endure. We have, we have, uh, we have heard of the patience of Job, and have seen the end of. And the Job is like to the remnant today, man. Right, it's, it's, it's suffering, long suffering, man. All right, we have the, we, 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 the, the, the scriptures are a lot, and that lot going 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 go, go into our uh, um, uh, comfort. Noah, right? This truth is our hearts, man. We have heard of the patience of Job and have seen of the end of the Lord, that the Lord is very pitiful and, and of tender mercies. Unto who? Unto the, the elect, right? But we're hopeful that the Lord is, t is tender towards us because, man, all be unto them, man, who is outside the truth. Who's got slacking? Alright? For above all things, 
my brethren, swear not neither by heaven, neither by the earth, neither by an oath, but the but let your uh, but let your uh, ye 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 select it. But let your uh, yea be yea and your nay and your nay be nay, lest ye fall into condemnation. That's it. Yeah, it's a scary thing, man, because I was, I was meditating on this a while back. All the original guys, pretty much from 2007 and 2008, and when the apostles came in 2007, the camp started coming out in 2008 and 2009. But pretty much all the original heads of all those camps are all out, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was yeah. always a switch. Yeah. You know? Some camp is full apart. I remember uh, the guy in Florida, yeah. Karataza. He used to be a brother called Karataza in yeah. Florida. You know? And, and he's not on the highways anymore. He's not doing his thing. You know, I used to speak with Chicago. Yeah, Chicago. Mm -hmm. he, used to, he used to be another guy in Florida. Um, he's from, I think he's from Barbados. But, uh, Rahamat, that was me. He was another splinter that came out. <coughs> the brother in Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, that was huge. Yeah. Yeah. So, so it's, a, it's, a, it's a thing where you look at it and say, yo, this isn't, it's not a joke, man. No. Uh, you know, because now, now you don't hear about those men. Those men are, they're, they're uh, what's the scripture say? They're, uh, it's, uh, Fallen stars, something like that, in the book of Jude, mentions that, right? But pretty much, Paul also mentioned about some men walking around right now weeping because they know they're the enemies of the cross of the house shadow. They were once a part of this, but now they know the spirit of the house This is Mark 10 and 28. It says, Then Peter began to say unto him, No. We have left all and have followed thee. And how shall I answer and said, Verily I say unto you, there is no man that hath left house or brethren or sisters or father or mother or wife or children or land for my sake and the gospel. But he shall receive an hundredfold now in this time houses and brethren sisters and mothers and children and lands persecutions and in the world to come out eternal life is a sacrifice, right? So we don't need to do the sacrifices daily anymore about the oblation and the incense and this and that. Right? The sacrifices is pretty much putting the Ahab Hashem Yoshev first. That's right. He's, that's a priority, man. Right? The woman, the woman comes in the way, well, you've got to punish her. So she's going in, she's going to her away. And that goes for anything, really. But many that are first shall be last, and the last first. A lot of you uh, top Jake entertainers, they're going to be last in the kingdom. You're going to be in the kingdom. You're going to be in safety and harmony, and you're going to feel good, but... The, 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 the first they're gonna shine it. just like you're shining we're looking just at like you shining shine. now yeah right? this is Jude chapter 1 verse these are spots in your feasts of charity when they feast with you feeding themselves without fear out there without water buried about the winds trees whose fruit with her wither it without fruit by skin plucked up by the roots raging waves of the sea foaming out of their own shame Wandering stars to whom is reserved the blackness and darkness of the Corinthians 9, verse 26. For so run, not as uncertainly, so fight I, not as one that beateth the air, but I keep under my body and bring it into yeah, that's subjection. Like, that's, like, that's like these guys saying, yo, we gotta, we gotta have a strap at camp, you know, get a uprise, we gotta do this. That's what they're doing. They're just punching it. They're, 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 they're doing this, right? What the hell are they doing? Right? In the spirit, what we're doing is we're tumbling the society in the spirit. This society is falling through the words that we're speaking to you by Shemi or Shai, by Shemi Kakudash. It's a spiritual power. It's a spiritual 
that were killing the seeds. That's right, casting down strong. Like it's your target, that's gonna get you winded, right? You know, more than if you actually worse, connect. Nothing worse than get hit with a shot you miss and then you get right. hit. Right. That's the worst <laughs> shot you know? do. Yeah. You miss? Oh. Right. <laughs> you know? Lest that by any means, when I have preached to others, I myself should be a castaway. Right, so examining yourself, you know, what lot you fit in. Right, are you grudging? Yeah. Are you trying to have self? Uh, are, you, are, you have, yeah. are you trying to have men praise you, gain glory, mm -hmm. gain worship? There's nothing to be worshipped and glorified in society. the society anyway. That's right. Right? You can't be glorified in the society. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Yahweh yeah. was, wasn't glorified. That's he right. went through hell. Who the fuck are you? Exactly. You got all right. I'm going to say All this bullshit. We need some videos. That's not what the Lord was about. That was not what the Lord was about, you know? And then he even cursed old Peter about drawing his sword. He said, put it back, right? When Peter drew his sword, he said, put your sword back. He said, he, they that live by the sword die by the sword, you know? Yeah, you got to just bug those, those brand of Lord's name on the neck. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, and, and it seemed, oh yeah, it has the Lord there's neck. You just don't want to, you want to praise to yourself, right? You want to see like, like you're holy, holier than, Anybody now, else. You know what I mean? But there's no way about it telling you you must write the whole day. Don't put no mark on anybody, man. Alright, so that's basically putting a cow. And you're picking up that golden calf. Same same idea. Mm -hmm. No, man, it's fairly true. Right? You know, everyday life, no one knows, you know, that, that, that we're part of this. Unless they're too big right now. Right? But every day you just go along, hey, what's up, Brian? Hey, <laughs> Sam, see you. And that's oh, yeah. it, mm -hmm. you know. That's what you gotta move, man. You gotta move in the spirit. We always say that move in the spirit. We spirit of what prophecy. That's 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 our idol. Are you gonna move in the spirit of harmless? Mm -hmm. right? Well, when you're that guy, you don't have to tell the people that you're that guy. Right. They know you're that guy. Mm -hmm. They just know by the way you move. Mm -hmm. But that's why these guys are all about that fame, glory, yeah. music videos, all the you know. They, they, Sisters, <laughs> yeah, we, we let our work speak for itself, man. Hey, didn't Paul say that you're aware of how you can build upon the other man's foundation? We're talking about some other shit, and then don't you know this society is being exposed? Look at your god, uh, Pit Buff Daddy. Yeah, yeah. And every all the rest of them that are gonna get exposed, man. All right. They're all, all like that. that. So all your gods are being casted down. Hey, you got yeah, man. last week, man. Yeah, yeah. That was a good video. Yeah, guys, yeah. That was what who he is. Yeah. He made a lot of points about Jake's yeah, being hypocrites, man. Mm -hmm. And Jake's and Jake's are coming for his head now. Yeah. You know? they, they can't stand yeah. anything about oh you do this and, and this in your community and no no they don't want to hear that. Mm -hmm. I think right. he had a show recently, and he got and he, they, they jumped in on stage. Yeah, they jumped in. Mm -hmm. So he, now to, to the white man, I'm selling out. I'm for sale right now because you guys, that wouldn't have happened to me, right? <laughs> exactly. And it's the truth, but it would have people's head. He's like, right. if, if I was, if I was, if I was selling out, you wouldn't have done that. That's right. mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That's because right. I'm for the people, you sure. guys doing that, that's right? And that, that's why the Lord said He's gonna He's gonna come against a hypocritical nation. We understand like, like like drugs and uh, gang culture that Esau pushed. You guys multiplied that. Right? Exactly. You guys, you guys accumulated down. garbage, man. You know. John four forty four. Mm -hmm. This is Baruch chapter four verse two. Turn thee, O Jacob, and take hold of it. Walk in the presence of the light. Because what's what, what's opposite or contrary to light? Darkness. I just say, so though we walk in the valley of shadow of death, so what's gonna is gonna remove that shadow is the light, and the shadow of darkness is Esau. Man. That's right. Psalm says, "My laws are a lamp unto my feet." Right? It's a guidance, guidance. Therefore, that thou mayest be illuminated. Right? See, so y'all just want to be by Illuminati, man. 
right here. It's right here. Well, you want to go on the, the left hand side, the left hand side can be trinkets, you can drop it, scrubs. Right? The Moses promised you, promised you us a kingdom, man, a beauty, a gloriousness, man, righteousness. But nah, you want to leave a shithole, man. Where they, you, they want to know if heaven got a ghetto. Yeah. Fucking <laughs> return. <laughs> God, there's a song like that, right? There's a song like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk, 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 talk. Give not thine honor to another. All right, don't let this, this truth pass you, man. Right? It, 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 it's like a mention that when it's truth or very diligent, where are they now? They basically gave their honor to, to another, man. Right? Nor the things that are profitable unto thee to a strange nation. O Israel, happy are we for things that are pleasing to Yahweh are made known unto us. Okay. Things that were made, were, were, was hidden. And I said, like, before the truth, what were we doing? You know, it's just stumbling, thinking of somebody, you're not. No, I'm the man. But two living, yeah, yeah, ah, man, you see something? He has pneumonia, man. That's right. He sneezed it. That's right. <laughs> you know, you're so badass, but you're in a fucking room with a thermometer in your mouth, fever. <laughs> yeah, right, God, you know? I can talk about you, man, my landlord. But you're the man. Verse 5 Be of good cheer, my people, the memorial of Israel. Alright? So when you remember something, something important to you. So the Lord say, hey, you're important to me, man. Yes, I am. God, a monument, man. Right? And be of good cheer. So we are, even though we're mourning, we're of good cheer, man, because we know it is true. God. Okay? Verse 8. Ye were sold to the nations. Right? Ye were sold to the nation. Who sold you? Obviously, your owner did. You can't sell something that you didn't own. That's silly. You can call a thief. Or sold you, sold you off, man. You know what I mean? But you know what? You, you, you like them so much, right? Because you, you, your words both be, be mingling seeds, man. You stay over there, we stay over here. We get mingling seeds. And that was caused in Genesis. That's, what, that's, what, that's, what, that's what, one of the things where downfall mixed with other nations, man, because of confusion. Right? To this day, man, they talk about all the badites, man. They, they, look, they look like Chinese. They can't be us. Man. And not knowing the history. Right? If you're not careful, you start talking shite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? So you were sold to the nation not for your destruction, but because you moved your Yahweh Shemiah Shai to wrath. You were delivered unto your enemies. So the Lord put her ass in with all of us. You know? There's no exemption because we all were wicked, man. Right? That's why we all have to repent. Like, no problem to say, it was not me. You know? I was good the whole way. <laughs> you know, but no, you guys. You know? <laughs> and that's Jake. You know? <laughs> no, 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 me? I, I knew you, man. No, man, you're all, all, all wicked, man. It's some fucked up shit. Well, the, the majority of us back here grew up celebrating Christmas. Con. So we're, 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 we're in sin. Con. Let's end that. This is uh, Revelation 14 and 1. And they looked, and lo, a lamb stood on the Mount Zion, and with him an hundred and forty and four thousand, having his father's name written in their foreheads. And I heard a voice from heaven, as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of a great thunder. And I heard the voice of harpers harping with their harps. And they sung as it were a the seal when you first read it you're talking about the seal read it again from the top that's the thawa those men have a thawa in them they have a light in them they can't help it it was given to them from the beginning of the earth there's something special about those men whoever they are and it's it's not women it's only men go ahead this is all men what you're reading right now there's no woman a part of this for you i worship women go ahead Revelation 14 and 1, and they looked, and lo, a yeah. lamb stood on the Mount Zion, and with him an hundred forty thousand, forty and four thousand, yeah. having his father's name written in their foreheads. Yeah, that name written is the Father. 
and then what are they known as as well? They're known as the 144,000. They're also known as the bride. The, 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 the bride, right? They're who? They're the virgins. They're the, the they're the wise virgins. Go ahead. They're the ones that never bowed the knee to Baal. Go ahead. And they heard a voice from heaven, as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of a great thunder. And I heard the voice of harpers harping with their harps. Yeah, because that's going to be a glorious day, man. That's going to be a day where this is actually going to happen, man. You're going to hear those things. There's literally going to be music playing, man. This is a glorious day, man. It's going to be one of the most glorious days in the, in the history of mankind. This is when the earth is going to be put back into order, man. Because the earth has never been in order before. The last time the earth was in order was going all the way back to the garden. And then you had the 40 year rule of Solomon and that still wasn't enough. This is going to be a global takeover, man. This is going to be an intergalactical takeover, man. Verse three, and they sung as it were a new song. Yeah, and it is a new song, even though it's an old song, right? It is new because first of all, new bodies, man. Second of all, it's going to be complete rulership dominated by the Israelites under Yahweh, under Yahweh and Yahushai, man. That's a beautiful thing. We've never had that before, man. We've never had that. We're going to be able to go to Yahweh and be like, yo, can I reason with you? Like, what? What? Are you crazy? What? Come on, man. He's sipping wine for us to drink with him. You can't even imagine that. You're going to be able to sit to sit and drink with your savior? Do you know how much personality he has? He's a joker, he's slick, he's smart. He's gonna be like, yo, I was watching you still. I you. almost slipped a couple times. <laughs> Go ahead. It's but, but, but Jake doing it for the remix, you know, Jake's, the remix, the new song. <laughs> oh, remix. <laughs> as it were a new song before the throne and it's not because it's just the law statutes and commandments right, right? It's, it's it's the same name it's the same glory it's the same thing that goes all the way back to romans 9 right nothing has changed it's all the same that's why it's it, it's it's known as the second covenant no it's the same it's the same old law it's going to be written inside of your mind go ahead and before the four beasts and the elders, and no man could learn that song but the hundred and forty-four thousand. And that's why we sound so strange on the internet. That's why we sound so strange telling these people what's about to happen. That's why you and your woman can sit there and watch the movie, The World Is Come, whatever the movie is known as. <laughs> Same thing. And then she's going to be like, oh, okay. Like, Damn, what the hell? What the hell? Yeah, it's a good movie. Oh, it's direct. Oh, uh, Barack Obama and Michelle Obama, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. They're just going to talk about Michael. Oh, you see the house? Michael. Oh, the Michael. house is nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're going to say some stupid shit. Yeah. Out of here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I bet you this summer a lot of bitches are gonna get the 69 tattoo. Yeah, yeah, I saw that dumb shit. Says which were redeemed. I'll read it again. Uh, yeah, which were. Four. I sinful nation. 
a people laden no, no. with stocks. No, where it says, um, uh, 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 um, what does it say again? Salah it says that they were, um, they, oh my gosh, what does it say? Read the whole thing, what a one. I said, what a one. Yeah. Of Isaiah, the son of Amos, which he saw concerning Judah and Jerusalem in the days of Uzziah, Jotham, and Hezekiah, kings of Judah. Hear, O heavens, and give ear, O earth, for the Lord Yahweh hath spoken. I have nourished and brought up children, and they have rebelled against me. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's grip, but Israel doth not know. My people doth not consider a sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seed of evildoers, children that are corruptors. They have forsaken the Lord Yahweh. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger. They are gone away backward. Why should ye be stricken any more? He will revolt more and more. The whole head is sick, and the whole earth faint. Nine, 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 nine. Verse 9, except the Lord Yahweh of hosts had left unto us a very small remnant, we should have been as Sodom and we should have been like unto Gomorrah. Yeah, and that's bowing to read, read, keep what you have in 9 and read what you have again. God, Revelation 14 and 4. Yeah, these, 14 and 4. These are they which were not defiled with women. Yeah, we weren't defiled by certain philosophies, yeah, right? Yeah, because yeah, it also, God. it that's, also that's says weird, in the scriptures that, that um, <laughs> um, what does it say? It says that. Um, keep keep reading. Keep reading. Yeah, that, that verse, uh, uh, fourteen and four. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Read, read it again. Read it again. Revelation fourteen and four. Yeah. These are they which were not defiled with women, for they are virgins. <laughs> exactly, and we're virgins because we came out of this world, man. Right? Those those men have been cleansed. That's how they're virgins. They're not virgins by themselves, they're virgin by blood. Right? That blood actually cleansed them. The, their, their sins are not being seen anymore. Whoever those men are. Right? So for you people, oh yeah, you're a sinner too. No, those men are actually not. <laughs> their, their sins have been blotted out. Okay? Let the brother read nine. Isaiah 1, verse 9. Yeah. Except the Lord Yahweh of hosts had left unto us. A very small remnant, mm -hmm. we should have been a Sodom, yeah. and we should have been like unto Gomorrah. That's why the scripture says, I have uh, saved 7,000 that have not bought the need to buy out. Right? Because a lot of you people, even right now, you're putting up Christmas trees in your house. Don't you know that's a sex symbol? That's a sex act going on in your house right now. What's a sex act? That's a penis. The woman on top of the tree is riding the penis. And then all that stuff on the tree beside, is sperm. Beside the tree, you have the womb. And that's What's the womb. What's that shit called? The ornament? The, 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 the uh, ornament. Uh, yeah. That represents the ball. And that's the, and that's the right? balls. So that's, that's right. right. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> they tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah, they <laughs> yeah, they're telling you. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the white stuff on the tree is the sperm. God. Right? And then you produce the gift. And the gift is supposed to be the sun, right? Right? And then you bow down and you pay homage, right? That's all a sex act, right? And that's disgusting. And you people don't even know that. These, keep, keep going. These are they which follow the Lamb whithersoever he goeth. These were redeemed from among men being the first fruits unto Yahweh. And the reason why they follow the Lamb where the, wherever he goes is because they're actually joined to him as well. There's something, there's a spiritual tether mm -hmm. that they have with always find Yahweh Shai, man. They will never feel comfortable, man. There's going to always be something that draws them back, man. Yeah, he said, my sheep hear my voice My sheep me. hear my voice and follow me. The water. That was beautiful. I didn't even think of that one. Go ahead. So being the first fruits unto Yahweh and to the Lamb. Yeah. And in their was found no guile, for they are without fault before the throne of Yahweh. Exactly. So their 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 sins won't be on display like the rest of the world, man. They've been blotted out, right? For whatever reason. And whatever reason it is, it's still a righteous thing. 
it's a righteous thing because they're gonna help. They're gonna help with the, with the destruction of this society, man. They're the ones that have to be out on the highways and the byways. They have to get the, the reason why we're out here is literally for them. The reconstruction and the rebuilding. And the rebuilding. They're gonna be the steward again. Jeez, man. Yo, what a glorious people, man. All right, we're going to close up with that. We're going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. Yahweh, Hashem, 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 Hashem,